Morning guys, my name's Julie and if you haven't met me before, I review skincare and I'm also on my own DIY journey. I've just had a long soak in the bath, so I'm just about to do a review on the Liz Earl products. I've been using them for a month now, so I've got four items which I've tried and I'll let you know how I get on. Right, the first one that I used was the Cleanse and Polish. Now this is a hot cloth cleanser. And it's £9 for 50ml, so it's reasonably priced. And um, what this does, it deeply cleanses and gently exfoliates your skin for a radiant looking skin. Um, you can get 100ml for £17 and you'll get two cotton cloths come with that. I don't like to use the cloths. I've tried them, I just don't like them. I just, I personally prefer to use a cotton wool pad. Um, it, what this does, it's enriched with cocoa butter, which does soothe the skin, so it'll soften and moisturise. It's got rosemary, chamomile, eucalyptus, and, it, and eucalyptus in. So I'm just going to put a little bit on my hand so you can see the texture. So it's quite thick and creamy. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to apply this all over my face. It smells really fresh. You can smell the eucalyptus really thick cream texture and it literally just melts into the skin i've got dry skin so as you can see i put it on and it's literally just melted into the skin it's really nice so i'm just going to wipe it off now i have already cleaned my uh, face earlier with the uh, Eva Lom cleansing balm, so this is like basically a second cleanse. Can you see it just gives your skin like a nice radiant glow and it just really softens your skin, so it's great for dry skin. As you can see, my face isn't really that dirty, it's just so I was quite happy with that, I was quite impressed with it, and I don't think it's reasonably expensive it's you know it's quite affordable so that was the first product i tried and then they've got a separate um product which is an instant boost skin tonic which is that but i'm going to use that next uh now what i'm going to use next is the soothing eye lotion this is amazing for removing makeup i'm just going to turn my bit of paper over because i've made some notes um it's called eye bright soothing eye lotion and this is great for tired and puffy looking eyes. And as you can see, I'm really struggling with my eyes at the moment. Um, it's got a herbal formula and it does soothe, hydrate all the delicate areas of the eye. It contains witch hazel, aloe vera and cornflower and it'll cost you £9 for 50ml. It's a really runny texture. It's like, it's like water texture. It's got a slight scent to it, but nothing strong. This is great for removing stubborn mascara. And it's quite cooling on the eye. It's a great, if you've got suffering with eye strain, you could just put a little bit on a cot on each cotton pad and then just, just relax and leave that on your, on your eyes. It's really cooling. You could even put it in the fridge. That's what I would do. It doesn't sting really nice i would prefer it to be more of a cream texture because i do like the cream cleansers um but yeah great i don't know if i'd buy this again because like i said i do prefer the the creamy textures to remove eye makeup but i can't find any fault with it it does what it says it is cooling on the eye and again it's quite affordable so what i'm going to use next is the toner and this is the Instant Boost Skin Tonic. Um, I quite like this. So what this does, this replenishes your skin with a soothing hydration. And this does prep your skin ready for your daily makeup, etc. And it does, again, it soothes and brightens the appearance of skin. It's alcohol free and it's non-drying. And this contains aloe vera, chamomile, cucumber and vitamin E, rose scented geranium. So, and sweet orange 
and again it's nine pound for 50 ml can't really smell um the orange in it i have to say and again this is a watery watery texture i'm just going to get a cotton pad and put a bit on as you can see it's like a yellow in color i've got i can't really smell much in it to be honest so considering it's got all them ingredients it doesn't really smell that strong again glides on the skin beautifully does what it says you can see my parrot in the background oh that's it it keeps flying around so yeah i do quite like that i think if you've got sensitive skin it might be a bit stingy because i got a sensitive area on my neck and i used it on my neck and it did sting a little bit so i would just do a just try it before you put it on your face if you've got sensitive skin but yeah again quite like it reasonably priced so that was the instant tonic and the last cream i'm going to show you is the skin repair gel cream i don't usually buy gel creams i do like the cream thick textures i'm not a big fan of gel but i have been using it for a month and what i was amazed at that this gives you moisture in your skin for 72 hours so it gives you refreshing hydration it does absorb fast into the skin again i'll put a little bit on my hand for you i've nearly used this Let's see if i can get some out i've been using it for the month you see okay so it's quite creamy texture what it does it does lock moisture into the skin and as you can see just again melts into the skin it restores the balance of your skin it contains barrage oil avocado oil and it's recommended for all skin types it's got it has got a bit of a where can i describe it it's a waxy smell it has got a bit of a waxy smell to it but it's not overpowering and if you want to buy 50 ml of that that's going to cost you 24 pound so as you can see it has given my skin a radiant glow a nice healthy looking shine um so overall i was quite happy with the lizard products i definitely buy the cleanser cleanse and polish I would definitely buy the Instant Tonic Toner. Love this, but probably wouldn't buy it, the eye makeup remover. Because um, again, I do like the cream texture, but it does what it says. And it's great if you do suffer with really puffy, tired eyes. Great to put this on a pad and just relax and let that soak onto your eyes. And I would buy, well, as you can see, there's hardly any left. The skin repair gel cream is amazing and it does make your skin feel moisturised for about 72 hours. There's my cheeky parrot. And that's it. So overall, I was quite impressed with the Lizelle products. Make an ideal gift at Christmas. Christmas is around the corner. Um, I managed to get all them on eBay and they were quite cheap, to be honest with you. So check eBay out before you buy Lizelle from Boots or anywhere else. Um, I hope you like that review. Please subscribe, like, share, come and follow me while I'm on my skincare journey. Help me try and sort these blinking puffy eyes out. Us ladies over 50, I'm sure it's the menopause that's got a lot to do with it as well because, oh my God. My eyes are terrible at the moment. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to put some eye cream on. But I won't be able to tell you much about this because I haven't done a proper review on it. I'm going to just see, it's with the refinery eye gel. So I'm just going to put a little bit on just while I'm talking to you. Let that soak in. I've got loads of eye creams I'm going to be doing a review on. So... Come and catch me again soon. Have a nice day, guys. Lots of love.